Okay, so the next type of video analytic rule we're going to make is the tripwire. So you create it the same way as, as the ground zone, but the difference is you just select tripwire instead. You can apply both of these to every camera that supports it. So um, you have that extra level of, of control over what you want to see. Again, if this camera is indoors, uh, we select indoors. If it's outdoors, we select outdoors. And we maybe if it's indoors, we put it up to um, a bigger suggested size so that we're not getting uh, a lot of alerts. But for this one, we're going to leave it at suggested. And we hit next. So this one, um, all you do is you create um, a trip wire uh, over the area you want. You can decide on going the whole way across the garden if you want. You can also decide on a smaller one uh, in the same area as the last one. But for this one, just as a matter of changing it up, we're going to put it over to the side here. And we can also decide on which direction we want it to go. So for this one, we're going to go both directions. And then again, we can decide on the delay between each clip. We're going to increase that to maybe five minutes. And then we want the rule to only be on, uh, during the following time. So we're going to select Monday to Friday from 9 to 5 p.m., which is essentially normal work hours. And then we're going to set it to not apply when the panel is disarmed. And then again, we can decide on which phones uh, receive um, notifications, but also which phones are in the uh, geofence area. So if we select all these phones, it means that when these phones are within the geofence, the rule doesn't apply. And again, we're going to select uh, person um, and animal. With the push notifications, we're going to just only maybe select the Samsung phone and the Vodafone phone. Um, and here you'll see you have an option of whether you want to attach a thumbnail of the trigger event or text only, we're going to leave it at thumbnail. And then we're going to leave the automation rule blank for this one and select save.